Hello and welcome to my webinar. Uh, let's get started. So today we'll be talking about my film Godless. We thought more about a wider secondary audience, which are young females. We relied on natural lighting, uh, for example, the outdoors, uh, the, the lighting from the sun for the outdoor scene. We shot at night and found out that we did not like it because it was very difficult for lighting purposes. <coughs> uh, and it's, uh, yeah. Like, we, we didn't have a studio, we weren't doing it in a studio, we were doing it uh, on, like, in the places. Um, having previously considered the Propian narrative theory, we took a more sophisticated approach by including an anti-hero. Um, yeah. And the footage was very shaky, then we used a monopod and stabilizing. So, uh, errors in the stabilizer are visible, so we sh should have used a tripod, and we will do that next time. Uh, because it's much more stable and much, much better. We included intertextual references or other post-mortem elements to widen our audience. Uh, yes, we did. Um, yeah, uh, we created idents, including some 3D art, some in 3D art software. Uh, the Studio Canal one and the Eds Up one is were both made in 3D software, 3D editing software. Uh, we used an external mic, we used a zoom one uh, for some scenes. Uh, we downloaded multiple fonts and installed them, many fonts actually, uh, which are many for both the title, like throughout, and the main title. Uh, we looked at micro detail titles, and we looked at in micro detail titles, fonts, editing styles, and characters, and how they are portrayed in several films. Uh, those have got their own blog uh, pages for that. Uh, you can, yeah. For titles, we experimented with multiple fonts and FCPS, FCPX effects. We had a de we had detailed storyboards. Uh, it will be sent to you by email. Uh, we had multiple pitches, three in fact. Uh, we developed a screenplay, which will also be sent to you and underneath this video and we also um, we also did reshoots after seeking feedback. We researched the genre and its audience, sampling film openings and budgets, box office and marketing, reading up theories like Mulvey's Male Gaze and The Gap Roll. We used a basic shot list, uh, which is also going to be emailed to you. Uh, we had an animatic, uh, we had we had a questionnaire to test our ideas on audiences uh, and we got very useful feedback. Uh, we used all manual controls on the camera, so that means no autofocus or any auto zoom. We tried out the green screen, but it did not work with our plans uh, because we had too much movement and too much interaction with the surroundings. Uh, we combined actual industry names with our own fonts with Apple Studio Canal which had a very specific, uh, we have them in a very specific order, uh, reflecting concepts such as the auteur, th auteur theory. Uh, we have Christian Zmuda twice, who is the director. Uh, we had lots of panning and tracking shots throughout the film, throughout the opening. We went l location scouting and took practice footage to test our ideas. Uh, we shot a lot of coverage, shooting ev everything multiple times, looked at useful cutaway shots and interesting framing opportunities. We used mise-en-scene for exposition, especially in the church scene. Uh, we shot handheld and regretted it, so we sorted to, uh, we resorted to a monopod, uh, which still wasn't great. We should have used a tripod in retrospect. Uh, we recorded replacement sounds as foley, ambient sound, and overdubbing a sigh um, in the kitchen scene. Uh, we found issues with sound, then used a specific sound recorder to fix those issues. Uh, we gave cast detailed instructions on clothing and looks, and yeah, to ensure that we got the preferred reading across. We considered theories like the uses and gratifications model. Uh, whilst planning. Uh, it's the first time we used the Lumix Panasonic DCGH5L camera. Uh, we sought out audience feedback on different, multiple different occasions. Uh, we did a re-pitch uh, 
twice. Uh, actually, probably more than that. We considered narrative theories, specifically Todorov slash prop and Bartes and many more. Uh, thank you for listening. Uh, goodbye.